Hello everybody and welcome to another brand new video on the channel. Now, things are a little bit different for today's vlog because in a minute you're going to see another intro because I was planning this video on basically being like a one day vlog or a couple of two day vlogs but I've turned it into like a three day mega vlog. So we're traveling, I'm going to do the mileage at the end but it's close to like a thousand miles in three days. It's been mad, you'll enjoy seeing it hopefully on the vlog to this wonderful wedding. Um, my good friend Sonny Bradley used to play for our girls, got married to my good friend Amy uh, here near Darlington. What an absolute lovely gaff this is. So I thought I'd do an extra intro to update the video to explain what's actually going on. So it's like traveling a thousand miles over a few days up to our sort of troubles. Apologies, I've had a couple of beverages, but we'll see how we get on. If you do enjoy the vid, please don't forget, drop a like and subscribe. I appreciate it. Right, you'll now get to Plymouth train station, which is where most vlog starts. And Thursday, because it's currently Saturday. More than all, and welcome to another vlog. And I wasn't actually planning on starting this vlog at Plymouth train station, but we are here again, as always, in shock news. Uh, I was going to do it at home, but the taxi turned up, so I had to sort my life out and go. Um, it's another day in the lifestyle vlog. We're off to London today, because we've got a very busy few days. We're doing a girlfriend turf shoot with the girlfriend turf gang, but that looks great. So we're doing that all day. Then we're off to see Mr. Danny Aarons uh, for his gaming glasses launch tonight. Uh, I don't know what we're doing after that, but that is the plan. And tomorrow we're going to Birmingham to see a short little man called Curbs. Uh, then we're going up north because we've got a wedding on Saturday. Don't know if you guys know Sonny Bradley, very good friend of mine. Used to play for Argyle, Derby, Luton captain. He's having a wedding, so we're going up there. And then Sunday, we've got like a seven hour journey home via London because the trains are down. Um, which is going to be absolutely well hung over. So it's a very busy weekend. So there might be a couple of vlogs from it, depending on kind of like how much stuff we get. But luckily we got the fastest train this morning. It's like three hours, which hopefully, considering the last two journeys and how much of a night there have been, today will be smooth. Um, for those sleep aficionados, I've had about two or three hours. It, that for me, that's quite a lot. We did stream last night, managed to get a few hours, which is better than nothing, and like rushed the packing this morning in about 10 minutes. So. I got my suit, that's good enough. But anyway, I'm sure I'll see you in London Paddington. I think we're going to Old Street to start with and then down to Central. So yeah, again, it'll be seconds for you and well, minutes and hours for us. But also don't forget, if you are new, please do subscribe. We're up to like 31,000 subs, I think. So thank you very much for that. I appreciate it. Right, I arrived at Paddington. We got a lot of bags today, so um, I'll probably have to like bring it back when we get across. We're going down Tottenham Court Roadway. Um, but you may have seen um, manager Jess in previous vlogs. She left a bloody dress bag on the train. Luckily, as you can tell, I'm quite out of breath. Managed to get it. That was close, very, very close. It would have muddied if it wasn't for that. I've had to step inside slightly because of the sun, but finally, like behind, this has been boarded up for literally probably over a year. The last few times I've come up here, it has been totally, totally boarded, but they finally done it. it actually looks really nice. I'm not sure what it is, and I don't know what the hunter is. I don't know if that's the brand or in London, it could be a coffee shop, who knows? But yeah, they finally done it up, so happy days. But I think we're gonna hop in a taxi today. No tube, I'm sorry to the tube aficionados. We've got the sleep aficionados, the tube aficionados. We're a bit lack on time, so. But I do basically try and get in a black cab where I can, so I watch some guy on YouTube, he's called Tom the Taxi Driver. Sorry, mate. His channel's class, I'm addicted to watching it. And I like learning about like London cab drivers and stuff like that, so I feel like I'm kind of obliged to black cab it, that where the tube sort of like isn't possible. Basically, we just got a boatload of bags and it's gonna make life a lot easier. Just managed to, um pop aside for like five minutes, but very, very fun shoot today. Um, I can't kind of like show too much. Yeah, first one of the day done, currently about 10 to one. Got some Nando's on the way, gonna scram that. Got another two to do. Um, gonna get to the hotel after that. Staying in Old Street today, never stayed there before. Might have mentioned that in the vlog already, if I haven't. Oh, hello. Hello. Um, Sorry, yeah, no, 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 be, no, be my guest, mate. I'm only vlogging. Do you want coffee? Oh, I'll have a cup of tea, please. Tea, no worries. Milky, no sugar, Milky. if that's right. Thank you. 
Yeah, there we go. Hey, can't knock a can't knock a free brew. Uh, gonna head up that way, and then we're going to see Mr. Danny Aaron's at his event later. By which point, then I'll probably fall asleep. We might go out for dinner. See what time it is. Like late, late on tonight. By the time we're done there. But yeah, fun day so far. And uh, if I can get a little bit more before the next sort of shoot, I will. But we're just gonna go and chill and get some dinner because I am blood and starving. Right, quick update for the vlog. We are at the Regen Gaming event with none other than the legend that is Mr. Brandon Smith. We're not commentating tonight. No, we're not commentating today. We're here for the glasses launch. Now, the vlog is a bit of a shambles because we weren't allowed to show like any of the content stuff. It's just me in like a dressing room. Oh, it's right, pretty, okay. but I managed to get in there. But then someone brought me a cup of tea, so I couldn't, I couldn't grumble. Right. When are you commentating on the next event? You off anywhere uh, nice? We're actually going, just got back from Dal Dallas, Texas. Um, we're going to Berlin for the E-Euros, the FC Pro World I didn't even know there was an E-Euros. Is that on I'm during... surprised you're not wearing your cross. Yes. No, I'm actually, I'm actually not. I was earlier, I'll be honest. And they spoke to me earlier, they're going to send me a new pair. Oh really? Yeah. I also, they, but they can't be branded, so I'm going to buy Please don't judge me. Woody from Toy Story ones. Oh yeah. Yeah, some Hamburglar ones. Do you think that's the way the Crocs are going? They're going to be like special limited edition. They're unbelievable. Yeah, they're unbelievable. And they'll be worth a lot of money. Well, you can't get the Lightning McQueen ones anymore. No. No, Ginger's got them. I'm fuming. Can you resell yours? I don't have that. Mate, all I've got is well. plain red. No, yeah, all I've got is plain red ones. Oh, okay. By the way, for the viewers that don't know, Brandon's was top Brighton hey. fan. You're not a Brighton fan? No, I'm a Plymouth, no, Brighton fan. Yeah, yeah, he is a Brighton but fan. I actually went and watched Plymouth about... Chat to Charlie Jack Smith. Four times, maybe last season. The Dartmouth Steam Railway. Apologies, the, uh, I've had a, a couple of others. Is it Janners? Please don't. Anyone that watches this channel knows I hate that song. Yeah, I'll be honest, I've been to a lot of grounds. Down in Plymouth, we're all known as <laughs> Janners. No, no, we don't. Imagine no. that, you walk out at like... The Riverside, they let you play Riverside and it's bouncing. You walk out and I always think, what do the away fans think when they're like, they're this in is the a song about in. pasties. Sorry to swear, but it literally is. Like, what did you think of it? As a um, I went and watched the game against Leicester when you won. Yeah, unbelievable. I, mean, I don't know how thing he scored. But I knew the Moose. How's he scored with your one shot? Because he's class. The, the Moose, up there. I think Sierra Leone have just won their like, qualified, was it World Cup qualified game? Yeah. He'll be there, will he? He loves it. Yeah, anyway, mate, lovely to see you. Pleasure, mate, as always. Um, the next part of the vlog, I don't know where we'll be or how many drinks we would have consumed. Is this going to be a 40 minute video? It might be. Look, I, basically, the plan was this is going to be a one day vlog. I think it's now going to be a three day vlog. Right, so I'm doing a stupid amount of miles. So, tomorrow's problem. And we've met our new friends from Chicago. Absolutely lovely people. We popped out for a gap. They were very inter interested, intrigued in the new stuff that we do. Can you talk about your bake? I've seen the baking, by the way, the sensational baking. Can you talk us through your chocolate cake with ganache? How do you do it? Yeah, I want it is, um, I've seen pictures, no flour, unbelievable. No They're flying, your flying stage is meant to, isn't it? Yeah, and, and with her cake, you're guaranteed to lose 30 pounds overnight. And I need that. Can you, for the viewers, right, can you just explain your flying schedule? This is mental for like the next few weeks. Yeah, yeah, so last week I was in Rome, this week I'm in London, next week Chicago, then I'm in Helsinki after that. Mental, and I don't like get, I don't like playing, so I need to like. Throw I don't like to walk, on. which is why I do playing. Yeah, that's a good. Thing. It's a good thing, right? Why that's a lot walk, of fucking walking. Why, why walk when you can fly? You got a favorite airline? United, United. Only United. Uh, okay. Oh, that, yeah. is that oh, you're loyal. You, you're no, no, she was really mad. We flew like 12 hours on United. We could have flown eight hours on America. But you chose United. United. I, I fully respect that. We love brand loyalty on this channel. I love that. that you went long. Absolutely. Yes. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. We subscribe today. Right? Yeah, we've got we've got some new subscribers. Uh, we'll see you in the next part of the vlog. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning. How are we all? I hope we're well. Sorry, I don't know where I ended up cutting off this vlog last night. I'm pretty sure. We were eating dinner, we, we met some Americans, they were lovely people, we had a great chat, must have been for about half an hour, 45 minutes, had a few cocktails later, things went a bit south, had some steak, ordered the wrong amount because I didn't realise that when it was set on the menu, it, it's like a set weight, so yeah, that happened, pretty much ate it all anyway though, so that was a good effort, so 
We are now heading to Solihull, which is just outside of Birmingham. We're going to go to Euston Station, get the train up, which is another X amount of miles. I know this kind of like video has changed from what it was originally supposed to be was like just a one day thing. But I thought, why not kind of show the travel of the three or four days because it is a silly amount of miles. We're going to get the train up there now. We've got a few things to do this afternoon. We're going to catch up with Curbs, uh, do a few things. Then I'm streaming tonight, basically, from Curbs' house. Uh, because I've got a sponsor's dream to do this evening and then the new Euros promo is out, so we've got to do that. And then we're getting, an, I think, basically, because I can't get a train that late from Euston, sorry, not from Euston, from Solihull up to, or Birmingham even, to Darlington, which is where we're going for tonight slash tomorrow, uh, we might have to basically arrange an Uber, which is going to be over like three hours, but it's come to a point where I don't really have much of a choice, and the only way to make it work for me to do the sponsor's dream and meet people and do things is do it this way, so yeah, it's even X miles, but it's another like three hours plus up from there onwards, and then Sunday it's like seven hours home, because we've got to come via London, because there's, yeah, just... There's just there's a lot of potential pain incoming, but we're just trying to enjoy the moment. So I'm gonna head to Houston. I'm gonna go and get a I think an upper crust. I was gonna get a Nando's, but don't know if you guys like an upper crust baguette. I do little maybe a little ham and cheese. Keep it simple. Fancy that. Walker's crisps. Sort me life out. I've had about three hours sleep. Shot for the aficionados. We go again. <laughs> do something on the go because um, it's very difficult to basically get anything because we have so many bags like genuinely like carrying stuff everywhere but we're on the train happy days we're currently entering Coventry he'll be playing with the championship again next season so decent fans actually um, hopefully that Sakamoto don't play for you anymore because he is a baller but we're nearly at Birmingham International, we're going to go and see Carabs, we're going to go into Solihull, happy days. We have to have a debate by the way, is it weird to have Nutella on toast? Apparently it's horrifically weird, I love it. Nutella, banana on toast, peanut butter, banana on toast. Let us know in the comments section, is that bad? The, the answer is no, yeah, no it's not bad, it's great. Carabs, I'm not, not recording yet, what was it you said then for the... It just made me look as tall as possible. Right, yeah, it's now recording. Hi, we're here with Curbs. Um, no, we're recording now. Um, it, it won't make the edit. Mate, get it in the edit. Zach, Zach, get yeah. In the edit. yeah, 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 yeah. His mate is editing this vlog. We're currently sunglass. We're sunglass shopping. There's some good. Op there's some good options here. Typically, though, all the nice ones are like a little bit more polarized. Yeah, polarized. Oh, what about these? That they've got some fire on them, and they're purple. Oh Jesus! Do you know what that would? Be? Is that? Are you sure that's fire or is that leopard print? Leopard print, mate. <laughs> I don't know. What, it's this red fit. I look like I'm doing comic relief. <laughs> no, I don't think. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know why I suggested that. <laughs> right, I'm putting them back. Oh, I don't even know where I got. Nah. But yeah, we're we are in the, the deep darkest yeah, midlands. Yeah. Oh yeah, look, I can get the mirror shot now. I'm like. How tall will you be? Curve, right. If I stand in the mirror, I'm there. Curve, you stand yeah. in the mirror. Look, he's yeah, no, 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 no. It's the angle, it's the angle. That you... No, 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 it's not, the, it's not the angle, I promise. It's not the angle. It's not the angle. About the matches, yeah. Yeah, I should say good morning. Oh, those massage chairs, but I'm flipping this around. Those things are unbelievable. I think actually when the banana bus got stuck, I spent about eight quid on them, and I'm not even joking. Yeah, they're unbelievable. No, we're at Tip Chef Services because Kerbs is driving us up north like three hours, the absolute mad lad. So thank you very much to him. He loves it. We've got the country and western blaring in the car. First time I've ever had this, they've got a McDonald's and apparently, sorry mate, they've got a staff member that's ill, so they they they, they can only do drinks. And I worked in bloody Mackey's. If you had no stick and have two staff members that are ill, it wouldn't shut. <laughs> McDonald's don't close for no one. So we now without any shame, this this reminds me of the Simpsons episode where Marge goes when they wouldn't serve us oh, at the yeah when they wouldn't when they wouldn't <laughs> serve us anymore at the all you can eat restaurant. We drove around looking for another one. We're actually going to another McDonald's. Yeah. Heart from Curbs. Heart. Heart. Desire. Pure heart. This is gonna be the greatest tasting triple cheeseburger I've ever had. And and the rest. Yeah, excuse the lighting. We've ended up in Chesterfield of all places where they had that chip shop that I used to like until it got suspected of being a terrorist cell. You can Google it, that's actually true. But we have the goods. It's time to head more north. Oh, right, just a quick update for you. This is literally, I'll check the time. 
20 past two and we have finally arrived in Darlington. I'm going to bed, but I just thought I'd do a quick, you know, day summary um, and how many miles we're up to because I can't, I've not been calculating it, but we've done in like the 24, 30 hours, we've done Plymouth to London, then gone to Birmingham, then gone to Sally Hull and Shirley, which isn't too far. We've been all around there, like there and back doing stuff. And then all the way up to Darlington. And tomorrow we've got to travel down a little bit, then back up and then Sunday, London, and then Plymouth again. It's gonna be close to a thousand miles. I'm gonna calculate it at the end of the video and find out. But anyway, we've got a very long day tomorrow. I'm going to bed, good night and I will see you when I next do. Bosh. Do you know what, that was the worst camera outro ever. If you try that again, you can even put it in the video and just go bosh. I'll tell you something as well, most people might know it about me, some of you might, don't, might not, I hate lifts. Absolutely hate them. Watched an episode of Fireman Sam when I was younger, got scared, but I've got no choice here, so I'd rather not. Also, gotta give a shout out to Curbs. I couldn't catch him at the Angst, we had so many bags, but what a legend for driving us up here. You will be sorted, my man. My hero, my mate. Thanks, pal. There's a statue out there, I don't know who it is. We'll call it Mr. Darlington. I'll go and investigate in the morning. Some bloke, the square looks quite nice. Also, by the way, right, we're in the Mercure. Can I just say, it was like the crystal maze to find this. It's like floor three, but you have to go to floor two and then up a different lift to go to another floor, floor three. I'm not joking, I feel like bloody Richard O'Brien. Where's me wind? We have one holiday too. Good morning. I've popped out to see Mr. Darlington, which is called Joseph Pease. There we go. Apparently he is a Quaker, the first businessman and benefactor of the town's clock tower. So there you go. Reminds me of like Back to the Future. Um, yeah, as you can see by my eyes, I'm always tired on these. Uh, I'm heading to McDonald's. I know, more McDonald's. The second McDonald's of the weekend. It's terrible. The last two weeks in Plymouth, I've been to the gym about eight, nine times. I've been eating well, travel away for a weekend. Oh dear, it's going to be McDonald's, it's going to be bad food, it's going to be probably a lot of alcohol. I'm very sorry to my body for what is about to happen, but nah, it seems like a nice gaff, this. Um, going to head to McDonald's, which is somewhere down here, but there's a bakery there. There's a Costa Coffee there. Look at this stuff. I'm working, by the way. Got to give a shout out to this lad at the party the other day that fixed my gimbal so I can move it again, which is uh, which is awesome. But I know this vlog has kind of turned into a bit of chaos, which it always does. It's like a three day weekend with uh, with pie. The room last night, by the way, was a Mercure, 72 quid a night, which I thought was pretty reasonable for a weekend. And I can confirm it was a very nice room. Very clean, very tidy. The staff were very friendly. Shout out to the gentleman on the desk, top bloke. And uh, yeah, the bed was uh, banging. Right, I'm gonna go and try and find this McDonald's. Got a hankering for a double sausage and egg. No, not sausage, bacon. Well, it turns out that apparently that McDonald's don't exist anymore, so that was a waste of a walk. So Eve Eats and the Boss Man Corner Shop, it is. The town itself was actually pretty busy for like 9 a.m. This looks like quite a nice pub. The Red Lion. Looks like very old school. Red Lion Hotel. Oh, and there's a Boss Man there as well. What's that place called? I always like to judge a takeaway by its name. What? Retro. Oh, it's a sweet shop. On Uber Eats. A sweet shop. Welcome to 2024, I guess. So like, I couldn't say anything last night because I had to keep the noise down. Because obviously it was like 2 a.m. But seriously, this place is like the crystal maze. Oh, I can smell toast. Like actually like the crystal maze. Um, we're on like floor three. Oh, oh, our room number is room number like three something. But we have to go to floor two, then to floor three, then get a separate lift again. I'm literally lost, mate. I know, like, like there's just so many floors. I don't know where I am. There's a room called the locomotion room. It's kind of who's gonna be in the, oh, hello, look at this though. Cocktail bar and meeting room. Nah, I think it's a bit early for a beverage. Nice gaff, but bloody hell, where's Richard O'Brien? You've got 30 seconds of time. Where's me crystals, mate? No lifts for me today. If I can avoid, I will. This is just never bloody ending. I just want to sit down and 
Drink Me Pepsi Max Cherry. Hey, £9.55 by the way. The great thing about the Norse. Absolute mad bag of stuff. Right. I think I'm here now. Who knows? Right, everybody, a little update. We are here. Now, this place is absolutely beautiful. Can I say, by the way, the people in the north are so friendly. Like, the people in the hotel are lovely. Like, everybody I spoke to is just, like, in shops and that. It's just really nice. People in, up north are so polite. Um, we've had a few beverages. The ceremony is done. Um, so, congratulations to Sonny and Amy, who are now married. Um, some people might not know, so basically me and Sonny go back from the Argyle days. Very good friend of mine, absolute legend. Um, so we've come up for the wedding, I've just snuck up. Now I don't know how much I can kind of like show or get in, um, but I know there's a few people who want to get in the vlog, so if I can get them I will. Um, although I might be a little bit wavier, like the longer on it goes, so who knows. But they are now married. Congrats again to you two guys. Love you lots. Legends. Um, we haven't had food yet, but they're already passing around drinks. This is, I don't know, some Prosecco thing, but we've had a couple. It's had some like pork crackling slash scratchings, which was like really nice. So yeah, feeling good. Not looking forward to the seven hour journey home tomorrow, but that's tomorrow's problem. Right, what is it called? It's a pie. I'm gonna have to, uh, no, I'll grab, I'm grabbing oh, one. Oh yeah, pie. Right, try it, how is the pie? No, get it on a blog, man. Yeah, oh no, we're getting it in. Is that right to try, a, is that right to, Thank you. Yeah, yeah but it's perfect, right, look, so I can flip it round. Oh, we should have done a pie and cheese. Right there. Oh, here we go, look. Bang. It's, look at the size. <laughs> oh! Fly <laughs> face! Fly <laughs> face. Look at the That's pie. nice, that. Can we get try and give it, give it a go? Give it, give it a try. Put it all no, in I can't, once. I can't go taste on. it. Look at the size of that pie. <laughs> <laughs> it's a I love it. There's a smallest, as the smallest pie. By the way, yeah, I asked Sonny, and he you said, "Bro, I asked Sonny, he said, put him wherever you want, just don't get the dress, so this could get messy." There we go. I just wanted to get the orchestra. Look at it. There's a string band. They're playing ACDC a minute ago. Look how class these are. Look, bloody brilliant. Absolutely awesome. So good. So good. Now nah, this place is class. Literally unbelievable. I have found Argyle legend, Jake Jervis. How are we doing? Everyone all good? Look oh, how fr all look good. at the, look at the <laughs> dapper. Okay, well, we had a little go, didn't we? Yeah, we're good to go. Looking very right. dapper. How are we doing? I said, I said, are you back? He said, I'm done. You know, is it, is it over now? No more football? Part of time, no, I'm transitioning me. Transition, that's what I'm calling it, transition. A transition. Yeah, yeah, so are you playing for anyone in this city? Go on, little. Yeah, I'll be playing part time. Hensford, Hensford Town. Hensford part -time. Town. That's me. And then I'm doing stuff away, working as like a mentor at different Premier League clubs and stuff like that. So that's me now. Nah, that's class. So we do go, we have had a few good nights out in Plymouth. 100%. We, we have, have 100%. We had a few good times. Everyone knows about that. So yeah, we've had a good time. Yeah, legend. Thanks for coming to the vlog, mate. Cheers, legend. My man. Legend. Cheers, my boy. Here he is. Congratulations, the new, the newly married man, my boy, Sonny Bradley, ex Argyle, got Luton promoted as captain to the Prem. Derby. Oh my God. Derby. Well, no, but Derby Part up to the championship this season. Congrats, mate. Thanks, mate. Thanks for having me. Thanks for coming on the vlog. I love, hey, I love you too. He's. Had, we're going all night on the drinks. Oh, yeah. Mate, I'm buzzing for you. Thank All that on the drinks. Yeah. Dance floor. Yeah. Two foot someone. <laughs> Straight red. <laughs> Get out of here. What do we think of Will Grigg? Who? Will Grigg. No, I'm not that? saying it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm not saying it. <laughs> he loves the what camera. Look. I tell you People what. People love the camera. <laughs> what a legend. Shout out to Adam. What a legend. Top man. We are. We we've got. We have another beverage. We've done the toast. We've had some bread. Have you had some of the bread? I've had three. I've oh, had it's too right. many. I've had too many. How many you had? One. I'll give it a seven out of ten. I love bread. Marco Pierre White, call me whatever you want in the vlog, I don't care. <laughs> Does the best bread. Is the only honestly I'll go there just for bread. But I love Nando's. Yeah. I love Weber's mixed grill what Weber's like spoons. Let's just say your garlic bready type. Love garlic it? bread. Weber's spoons do a really nice like thin garlic bread, but Mark up here like just bread. I love it. I love bread. That's why I'm a bit portly. <laughs> hey, hey, thank you, mate. Sorry, Sorry no, thank I, uh, you. I can pay much. cash here. It's a miracle. <laughs> no, no. Do you know what I've been doing, right? See, I've been what I've been doing. It's been it's been 18 pound around. So every round I'm getting two pound change, and I'm getting nine rounds all night. So that the, <laughs> the ninth round will be free, and I can pay free. my coins. Respect. They're not free. <laughs> there we go. 
Hello my friends, my camera is telling me I have 6% battery left. So why it's slightly still light and I have some battery, I thought I'd pop outside. Apologies, I am quite wavy. You can blame Jake Jervis and Jordan Slew. But um, yeah, this is like probably gonna be the end to the wedding segment. Apparently, so there's a band now, and then later they've got a DJ, his name is Ben Laney, that they know from Hose, I beat the DJ, and there's like an underground thing going on, just ridiculous. So that I'm sure will be filthy. So yeah, the plan is do that, and then get the train at 8 a.m. So I'll probably bring you back for my steak tomorrow, uh, which will probably be me passed out on the floor of a train. And yeah, sorry, it's, honestly, it's chaos, isn't it? It's absolute chaos. I have acquired some glasses. I will see you probably tomorrow. Cheers. Well, it'll be seconds for you, but tomorrow for me. You get it at this point. Bang. Hello again, and welcome back uh, to the vlog. I'm pretty sure the last time I left you was last night, um, and I was feeling a little bit worse for wear. I actually ended up not going too hard, got a little bit of sleep, and then we've had a very busy day today, so I do apologise. We've literally travelled from Darlington down to London, which was like delayed, and then I couldn't record it because we had so many bags. I literally, I mean, we legged it, legged it to Paddington, ran through the barriers with like a minute to go, and the train was delayed by like 10 minutes anyway, because another driver, so there wasn't any need for that, but honestly, we were late to King's Cross, and I mean, we flew it across, so we're just on the train back now. Not feeling too bad, just need some sleep, but I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna get kit for a few hours, watch the Grand Prix, and hopefully, stream tonight so if you did enjoy the vlog this will be the outro so thanks very much for watching and please don't forget to like and subscribe uh, if you are new uh, leave a comment on what you want me to do in the future i might be going to an england game i don't know what the plan is yet i've got three percent battery left because i left my uh, charger in Curbs's car because i'm an idiot uh, so i don't have that so we're just gone past taunton we've traveled today four times it now so it's two o'clock now, we left the hotel about eight, so about six hours. Should get back in Plymouth for about an hour and 20 minutes, and I can go to bed. But thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers!